Alrighty then, welcome back to some more episodes of Ghost Trick, the man without a dick. Uh, welcome back to Ghost Trick, Phantom Detective. Uh, I hope you guys got a good feel of what this game is, and hopefully it's pretty good. I like it, I did a little bit more research in it, and apparently... <clears throat> Uh, I believe the writer for the Phoenix Wright series, he actually uh, oversaw this or he wrote for this. Uh, so that's actually pretty awesome. Uh, from what I've played personally for from Phoenix Wright, which I've uploaded to the channel, I haven't finished that playthrough. It's, it's abandoned. I'll never finish it. But um, Phoenix Wright is really good. It, really, really good. And hopefully uh, I'll have the same... This, this will have the same potential. Where the fuck is my cursor? What's going on? What's... Oh yeah, we saved! I better not let her out of my sight. And besides... I'm not the kind of guy who can just let a woman sit sneezing in the cold rain. I think I'll try to move closer. Ghost trick! Ghost trick! I'm guessing I have to do a trick. Trick. Um. Not what I. Huh? Oh, shimmy. Okay, there we go. What? Oh, you just—he turned the handlebars. I was like, "What? Bikes don't shimmy." <clears throat> Aren't you guys gonna have fun with me doing puzzle games? Oh my goodness! Open. Oh, look, I'm going to float down. Look at that. Here, girl. <laughs> Use me. All right, what's she saying? What in the world just happened? That crane moved all by itself, and then that big iron ball fell all by itself. It started raining all by itself, and then an umbrella came down. All by itself. <laughs> <gasps> oh my goodness. Don't tell me I have psychonetic powers. Did this whole game is this girl gonna think that? That'd be funny. That'd be awesome. Yes. I would have. I would have tried to uh, pick up the umbrella. Do people just sneeze in the rain when it's wet? Cause I don't. I get my senses get cleared if it's when it's raining. My senses, my sinus. <sighs> Alright, oh look, a little kitty! That wasn't there before. Meow! I hate cats, I'm just gonna let you guys know that. I prefer dogs, those things are little assholes. Alright, let's see. I'm <laughs> just chilling enough with my body. Actually, there's this thing right here. Yeah, let's see. Red headed target. Ray of Light, Hunter in the Dark. These, all these people have names. Phone book. Huh. I guess it's stuff that I'll read within uh, my own time, just to get a better understanding of the story. What the hell? Ah, it looks like she's saying something to herself. Dude, you're inside the umbrella. Come on, man. I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Oops. I don't know what to do. Oops. But seriously, what in the world just happened? Oh, girl, you stealing stuff from dead people. What's this? Some kind of no? Am I supposed to trick it? I want to see that note. I wonder what I wrote in it. Hopefully it's not just a shopping list or something. Yeah, that wouldn't help. Should I check it out? Nope, let's just stay here and stare at it. <laughs> Examine. I must look at myself. Did I... <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm still recovering from being sick, and it's been like a week. I have a cough, but my voice is pretty fine, but my cough makes me go a little out. <clears throat> my throat doesn't hurt anymore, so it's all good. Did I write this note? Maybe I should give it a read. So you don't remember writing it, eh? No, I don't remember writing it. But even more importantly... 
<clears throat> Uh-oh. Ah, I didn't get the chance to read the note. Not to interrupt your train of thought, but... I wonder if you realized we're where this telephone is calling from. Huh? How would I know that? Think back. Before you helped uh, her invert her fate, didn't a telephone comp come in and around this time too? Oh yeah! Oh yeah, when my body fell. <laughs> After you got done killing her. It's done, see? I'm on my way, yeah? That telephone call! Exactly. In other words, at this very moment on the other end of the telephone line is the culprit who ordered your murder. What? Let me ghost trick. I recommend you possess the telephone. Once you've done that, I'll tell you about another one of your ghost tricks. Ooh. Well, I could go through, go through wires? And then I saw him. Right there on the other end of the line. I saw the face of the man who ordered me dead. So, <laughs> Bushy brow, come on, Rock Lee. Is it done? Speak up, man. Did you get her? Who's this? Hmm, yes. A thousand pardons, my dear lady. I must have dialed the wrong number. <laughs> what a dub. That's a big book. Come on, man. Trace complete? So that's him, eh? That man who stole my life. That's right. <coughs> <coughs> sorry. I'm sorry for the coughing. <clears throat> But I gotta get a recording done. It's been a week since I've recorded anything. <clears throat> That's right. So what do you think? Would you like to go see him? You better believe I would! Then you would do well to listen to me. We ghosts exist by possession inanimate objects, however. There is only one way we can move from place to place over a great distance. And that would be... The dead can jump from point A to B through power lines. Yeah, I was right! Phone lines, well, same. Say what? I've done all I could do to help you. You have to do the right. <laughs> fucking asshole. You're not coming with me. I'm afraid not. I'm a mere lamp. My powers have grown weak. I've already used up most of my remaining strength just to get here tonight. But I had to come to ask for your help. My help? Many mysteries, mysterious things will happen in this town tonight. I'm trusting that you get the bottom of the truth and find out- Is that him in the future? You're the only one who can do it. I want you to use your powers of the dead to find this truth. I'm grateful to you for everything you've done, but I can't promise I'll help. Tomorrow morning, I cease to exist. I cease to exist. That doesn't give me a whole lot of time. I need to per uh, pursue my own mystery. Find out the truth about myself. That's more than enough. Huh? If you succeed in doing that, you'll have done what I've asked anyway. The two are one and the same. One and the same? Huh. This desk lamp knows a whole lot more than he's letting out. It's kind of funny. He said you basically read into your mind. You can't really have hidden thoughts, can you? Now then. From the... From the call a moment ago, you know how the call for its telephone, no, telephone number. The rest is up to you. Look, you can travel through lines. You got a phone number. The junkyard. S -s -um. Oh, so I can travel to him. Here we go, boy. Alright. Jacking in. <laughs> and so the story of the search for myself begins. A story that will last one night only. Tomorrow morning. I will cease to exist, and I'm surprisingly okay with that fact. I have to find the answers before the sun comes up. Why was I killed? What exactly is going going to happen in this town tonight?
If it transitions to a new scene, I'm doing another video. Haha, ha, we have to do another video. Too bad, guys. It's at the 10 minute mark. <laughs> it's at the 10 minute mark. Oh, goodness. Sorry, let's save.